Wait a minute. You two know each other? You look exactly the same. I do not. <laughs> I'm eminently more sophisticated. That's right. You cut your pigtails. That makes all the difference. Oh, you bum. Sonny Corinthos, would you get over here? Excuse me. Would someone please tell me how this is possible? Um. Benson. Yeah. We grew up together. Great. Yeah. So, is this the guy you were telling me about? I might have mentioned him in passing. Uh -huh. I would have loved to have been a fly on that wall. So let me look at you. Huh. Not bad. You must be doing good for yourself. I'm making it. Dare I ask how? Probably not. How's the family? Oh, so what changes? Every time I bring your name up, Louis still hops on the 300 bucks he says you owe him. Your family still remember me? <laughs> Who's going to forget <laughs> the bad boy of Bensonhurst, right? So this is absolutely unbelievable to me. This, Sonny, is your boyfriend? I wouldn't call him that. <laughs> what would you call him? She's kind of just waiting until the real thing comes along, man. <laughs> hey, you could do worse. So what are you doing in Port Charlotte? Oh, well, of course, you would know. This is my band you're about to hear. Oh, you're some kind of, like, groupie chick band? <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me, bite your tongue. I happen to be a professional. Oh, Lois, I mean, you got a lot of potential. You don't need to be... <laughs> She's not a hooker. Oh, no. I'm the manager, <laughs> you mental giant. Really? Yeah, really. They're all mine. It's true. For better, for worse. Oh, that's great. Yeah, would be. Would be really great if the lead singer would decide to show up. <laughs> 